Hi, I'm Miley with Kentfield Kennels, and today we have Hobie, who is a part of the Alina litter, um, born on July 16th. He is going to be flying out to Washington tomorrow, and so I was just going to let his show his new owners some of um, what he can do and his commands. So this is what I like. He's a very polite, easygoing little puppy. He loves attention and he loves food. Um, right now he's doing exactly what I want him to do, which is sit there politely until I tell him what to do next. Hobie, he knows his name, he makes eye contact, and give him a treat. So let's start off by lay down. Hobie, lay down is just finger pointing where he's gonna go. I have a treat in between my middle finger and my thumb. And I just take it from his nose in a sit position and I bring it down to the ground and say down. Nice. Nice. And try that again. Just so you can see it in one motion. Down. Hobie, down. Nice. Nice down. Nice down. One more. He'll be down. Down. Nice. Nice. And the longer he stays down, the more treats he gets. Nice. Command for sit. I just bring my hand up sit, he gets a treat. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. I'm going to get him to stand up so I can show you how to make him sit. Hobie, here. Sit is just a fist above his head and you say the word sit. Good boy. He also walks really well on a leash. He knows heel. Um, how to sit at your side. The cue to go is let's go. Hobie, let's go. Let's go. Good boy, let's go. And when I stop, you should sit. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Get him to lay down again. Remember, finger, treat, and down. Nice. Nice. And you want your puppy to stay down for at least 10 seconds. This is really good for him because he, he hasn't heard any other cue telling him to get up from a down. So I just kind of feed the treats to him as long as he's laying down. On to our next task, sit. Nice. Let's try and get stay. So I just drop his leash. Stay is a flat hand in front of his face and you say his name to get his attention and then you say stay. Hobie, stay. You just can walk around. Stay. Hobie, oh, here. Nice boy. I want him to sit directly in front of me. I don't want him running into my space or jumping on me. So he needs to know to come, slow down, and sit directly in front of me. Nice boy. Yes, he's a nice boy. And he gets lots and lots of praise when he does the right thing. Hobie, let's go. Sit. Sit. So one thing we're working on is he likes to come around me and sit directly in front of me when we're walking. So I just kind of move my body to where he should be at my, at my side. Sit. Nice. This is right where I want him. I want him right there at my hip. Nice boy. Does he stay one more time? Stay. I'll just walk around. Nah. 
Sit. Sit. Where are you? Stay. Stay. No. Sit. Stay. Okay. I'm just gonna make him wait, and since he wanted to follow me, no. Sit. Sit. I'm gonna walk away and come back to him before he gets a treat. Stay. Nice. Nice. Stay. He'll be here. Sit. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Good boy. Good boy. Let's go. He also knows how to go up and down stairs, wait for his food, and go on nice walks. He's been out in public to Home Depot and Lowe's. Um, so he's pretty, um, he's seen quite a bit as such a young little puppy. Yeah. Nice boy. Nice boy. Now when you bring, when you get him to your new home, he might try and test you a little bit because he doesn't know that you know that he knows how to do all of this stuff. So he might test you a little bit, but just stay consistent. Train him for at least 15 minutes a day in your new home and let him know that you know how to make him do all this stuff too. And he'll respect you a lot and he just wants to be good. <laughs> He's a pretty loving little dog. Oh, Hobie. Oh, Hobie. Oh, Hobie. Good boy. Good boy, Hobie. Good boy, Hobie. Yeah. It's just fun. Um, all of this stuff that I showed you in this video today will also be in your puppy packet with um, all your paperwork. And it'll tell you how much he eats, um, what he knows how to do. That's it and mom, dad, pedigree, all of that good stuff. Good boy. And that'll be all. Here's Hobie.